with Jeff. This is Craig Nook. Station here in central Otago and apparently they've got some pheasants here which are quite unusual in the South Island so uh, they've been rearing them and liberating them and uh, developing a bit of pheasant shooting so uh, I'm looking forward to meeting the locals here see if I can't get my first South Island pheasant. We are in the Maniatoto Valley in central Otago. It's a beautiful region rich in gold mining history and today rich in trout fishing and hunting. We're here for the pheasant shooting. The dogs are just as keen. They really love it. What do you reckon, Rich? I'm just pretty keen to get uh, to see one for a start. <laughs> and then shoot it. Why then I've bloody got bucket loads of ammo and... Uh... Just make sure you don't tackle him, mate. Yeah. Start hitting it and just quietly in. There's a couple of good rocks over in here. Just get up on me. Yeah. I can uh, stay put. But I'll, I'll tell you where to go anyway as far as that goes. Oh, okay. Ducks pointing in those rocks before we even start. Ah, just a bit of pheasant in there earlier today. Boy, this is great country. Everybody has an assigned position because safety is paramount. And of course the vests help in this respect. The dog handlers love the opportunity to give their dogs a run where there are a lot of birds. Birds everywhere. Coming down, down the creek. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Another one coming, Rich. Another one running up. I'm on the board. I missed the first two. Easiest shots in the world. Typical Jeffrey. Missed the easy ones. Richie's going well. Andrew Hoare's killing him over there. This is fantastic. Oh, Richie's up there. The number seven at the back of the line out, picking off all the ones that go over that side. I'm sort of being a bit of a, a bit of a prop burrowing in the middle down here. And the hooker's over there taking care of all the all the all the balls that are thrown out a bit long at the back. He's got him, he's got him. Good boy. That was magical, mate. Hetty, come. Come here. Right. Sit. That'll do. Good dog. Now, get her. Get her. Time to take stock and pick up the birds before we move on up the valley. We'll get in here and see what we've got. Yeah. Oh boy, stop. 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 He's the ones you see in pictures. Yeah, <laughs> you know yeah. I mean? yeah. The pretty ones, eh? Yeah. <laughs> you engage them by their um, trophy. That fella said his tail taken out, but by how many um, uh, rings they got on their, on their feathers? Oh, yeah. The me and Andy shot one there the other day at 42, but the biggest were shot for it's 39. But these fellas will, well, he's. He's 27, so you, yeah. you see so what I mean? Like 42, jeez. Yeah. So Strict. that doesn't matter on age, it's just how oh, no, trophy yours. It has to be sort of three or four year old yep. to get that there. Yeah. These will probably just be um, yearling birds, maybe two year olds. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Good evening. Evening. This is uh, a lot of fun, this. I was pheasant shooting, I didn't know what it was about, but uh, pretty pleased I'm down here. 
Week off. It's good. We found another small mob of turkeys. And Richie's on the board. And I managed to connect also. In the middle of the bush, walking all morning up the gully, working hard. And look, here the ladies have come out here. Had a beautiful barbecue. And uh, boy, toss sausage tastes ten times better. Right here. And I have a bit of steak on it as well while the sausage is cooling down. So, yeah, you. Yes. Not bad, Stevie. It's not bad. A good bag of birds, and they're all going to a good home.